So my thought for this morning is um, regarding optimism and pessimism. So me, personally, I'm always trying to be an optimist. Sometimes I find it difficult. Um, sometimes life throws things in your way that just makes you slightly pessimistic or, or negative. Um, but I think it's important that you continue to push forward and be as optimistic as you can to look at the great opportunities. For example, I was just listening to, to Tony Robbins' book, Unshakeable, and he was saying about even in a market, which is a correction or however you want to describe it, or or recession, um, this is actually when there are huge opportunities to get prices for stocks very cheap which will which will rise very quickly uh, after the correction has occurred um, so and you listen to Warren Buffett and he says that you can get compounding as you go long term instead of so these are all these are usually successful guys who look to the optimist side that even if there is a correction even if there's a recession this is all opportunities that um, that appear um, also, just a little bit more micro level than that, if you think about in the office, if you think about um, the, the most positive person, now there's a tricky line between being um, optimistic and being a little bit over the top and a little bit too much for people to deal with. That's something that you need to just, you want to be positive, you want to be enthusiastic, you want to be keen, but you don't want to be full on and people then turn away from you because they kind of think it's not really that enjoyable to work with if you're that over the top. So, but that's too far. But the the optimistic, positive person you want to be thought of as a positive person in the office and, and ready to be able to give when given opportunities, take them and deal with them correctly and really do them as best you can. So I would say that on micro and macro level you really want to try and be an optimist as much as possible it gives you the better long-term um, solutions to your problems and it gives you a better way of out looking at them so yeah so good luck um, it's, it's not if you're naturally pessimistic it's not easy to change your your outlook but it is something that you can flex it's, it's a skill that you can develop it's something that as long as you keep on trying and keep on doing you more than likely will be successful all right thanks a lot speak to you soon bye